introduction to the book of Genesis. Genesis was completed by Moses in the wilderness of Sinai in 1513 BCE. Born in 1593 BCE, Moses was a prophet, leader, judge, historian, and mediator. He wrote the first five books of the Bible, called the Pentateuch, as well as Job, Psalm 90, and possibly Psalm 91. An Introduction to the Book of Isaiah Isaiah served as Jehovah's prophet. He wrote the book bearing his name while stationed in Jerusalem, the capital of the two-tribe kingdom of Judah. Isaiah had two sons, Shir Jashub and Meher Shalahashbaz. Their names signified events that would soon affect the kingdom of Judah. Isaiah prophesied for at least 46 years during the reigns of Judean kings Uzziah, Jotham, Ahaz, and Hezekiah. He completed the book sometime after 732 BCE. Hosea and Micah recorded their prophecies around the same time. Some of the events foretold by Isaiah were the fall of the northern kingdom of Israel, which occurred in Isaiah's lifetime. The destruction of Jerusalem, which happened more than 100 years later. The fall of Babylon, about 200 years after Isaiah's day. And the appearance of the Messiah, which occurred over 700 years after the prophecy was recorded. An Introduction to the Book of Luke Luke was a physician. Like the Gospel writer Mark, Luke was not one of Jesus' twelve apostles. Also, Luke did not refer to himself as an eyewitness of the events in Jesus' life. He became a disciple probably sometime after Jesus' death. In time, he traveled with the Apostle Paul. Luke's Gospel covers the time period from 3 BCE to 33 CE. He wrote in logical order, often chronologically. Nearly 60% of the material in this book is unique in comparison with the other Gospels. For example, at least six of Jesus' miracles are found exclusively in Luke's account. Luke uses more than 300 terms that were either used in medicine or to which he gives a medical meaning. Only Luke speaks of a man full of leprosy and of Peter's mother-in-law having a high fever. Luke likely wrote his gospel in Caesarea while Paul was in prison there, from about 56 to 58 CE. So although appearing after Mark in the Bible, Luke was the second of the four gospels to be written.